The James Webb Space Telescope has been available since its launch toward the end of 2021. It has completely changed our perspective on the universe. However, now something has changed. The most powerful telescope humanity has ever built just captured something so remarkable, so unfathomable, that prominent scientists are calling it a crisis in physics. From galaxies that cannot support life, James Webb's most recent discoveries detailed in the book Beyond Earth have shattered the limits of understood science. What if all we thought we understood about the birth of the universe was wrong? Stay with us because the next thing you'll see will alter your perspective on the night sky forever. It all began with a whisper in the cosmos galaxy's faint signals that defied all preconceived notions. In July 2023, a group of astrophysicists analyzing Webb's deep field data uncovered three unusual galaxies. These galaxies were unlike anything seen before. They did not produce any light or conform to our expectations of typical star formation. Instead, they hinted at the existence of something brand new, dark stars. These theoretical objects, powered not by nuclear fusion but by dark matter, could have formed in the early universe, growing to unimaginable sizes. Now, scientists think these dark stars may be the missing piece of the puzzle behind the abundance of black holes throughout the cosmos. Additionally, there's a frightening aspect. Dark matter comprises 85% of the universe, yet we continue to lack understanding of it. If dark stars are real, they could alter the entire narrative of the evolution of stars. But Webb was only getting started. The Webb then turned its attention to a distant world named GJ1 to 1 for B, a super-Earth circling a red dwarf 40 light-years away. Initially dismissed as too hot and cloudy to study, Webb's infrared tools penetrated through the thick atmosphere. What they found left researchers in shock. The planet not only contained enormous water vapor clouds, but also parts that were surprisingly habitable. Even more shocking was the discovery of methane, a compound often linked to biological activity. Now, some scientists think GJ1 to 1 for B could be a watery world entirely covered in oceans. Could life exist in such an alien environment? We may be closer to providing an answer to that query than ever before because the James Webb Telescope has begun revealing something unprecedented, worlds that mirror our own in temperature, composition, and possibly life. When we think of smoke, we think of earth, combustion, fire, and industry. But what if I told you Webb just discovered smoke signals 12 billion years ago? That's right. During observation of a galaxy at the outermost observable universe, James Webb detected organic polycyclic aromatic hydrocarbons, molecules that are also found in smoke essential to Earth's existence. Because these molecules were in a galaxy so distant that their light has taken over 12 billion years to reach us, Webb was only able to locate them because of the gravitational lensing phenomenon which made the light from the galaxy bigger. The implications are profound. If these building blocks of life existed for a long time before life began to exist on Earth, life may not just be possible, it may be inevitable across the universe. But Webb was about to reveal even more bizarre information. Webb's greatest achievement was recreating what once took Hubble 11 days in less than 24 hours. However, what it revealed wasn't just beautiful, it was disturbing. Webb's ultra-deep field showed galaxies so old, dense, and structured in such a way that their existence poses a threat to the very foundation of cosmology. These galaxies shouldn't be there. Our current models indicate it should take billions of years for galaxies to reach that level of maturity. But there they are massive galaxies with supermassive black holes less than 600 million years after the Big Bang. Some of the black holes are 1,000 times larger than the one in the center of our own Milky Way. It's as if the universe fast-forwarded through evolution. Joe Alia, an astronomer from Penn State, confessed, This is the most puzzling and intriguing collection of objects I've ever seen in my career. If our models can't explain these ancient giants, then perhaps we've misinterpreted the entire beginning of the universe. Manufactured. However, 
What shocked experts was more than just the splendor of the image, the unanticipated duplicate of its spectral fingerprint. Webb, in short, was capturing what seemed like a perfect version mirrored of the same galaxy a little out of place and time. Even though gravitational lensing can result in visual distortions, these were different here. Energy was synchronized in both versions, fluctuations, identical redshifts, and identical motion in star clusters like an echo of the architecture of the universe. Some theorists now entertain the unthinkable, are we experiencing an artifact of a multiverse? Could it be so? Realities intertwined and woven into the space-time fabric, only visible through tools as precise as the web. If so, the telescope might be more than just a window into the far-off past, but parallel versions of ourselves as people. Web sensors, despite their primary focus on the spectrum of infrared light, can also detect vibrations of a very low frequency, basically the sounds that come from space. Early in 2024, while keeping an eye on a dying star in the Carina Nebula, a web image captured a rhythmic, low-frequency pattern unlike any other stellar extinction. When converted into sound waves that can be heard, the frequency was like a pulse that kept going with eerie precision, spaced. Astrophysists had anticipated chaos, irregular patterns typical of dying stars, but this one was eerily ordered. Some compared it to a heartbeat, others to a coded transmission. The luminary had entered its death throes and seemed to be signaling as it turned into a black hole. Whether this is a naturally occurring cosmic rhythm or something more deliberate remains open to speculation. However, the fact that dying stars may not only leave behind light but a song raises unsettling questions. Is the universe attempting to communicate despite its demise? The data from Webb is too vast, too difficult for humans to analyze on their own. That's why, for the first time, NASA incorporated a machine learning model designed to interpret raw web telemetry. The AI, trained on patterns of known cosmic phenomena, was given the task of recognizing anomalies. More than that, after several days of silent crunching, the model flagged a data stream not once but three times. It showed a spatial region devoid of galaxies, stars, or dust what astronomers call a void. However, in this void, the AI detected an oscillation pattern that did not correspond to any known error or artifact. When pictured, it formed a rotational spiral, not of matter but of gravity distorted. And here's where it gets chilling. The same pattern had appeared briefly in early Hubble data but it was ruled out as noise. Webb had confirmed it. Whatever this is, it moves, it pulses, and it transforms the world around it like a lens. The AI did not classify it. In its report, it used a single, unidentified label, entity. Webb's most recent revelation may be mind-bending. While mapping distant galaxies in a sector near the constellation Fernax, astronomers discovered a thing, a temporal distortion where redshift data from galaxies in the same region appeared to move backward in time. This is not only odd, it's impossible under the standard model of cosmology. The redshift should increase with distance, which symbolizes earlier light. But in this pocket of space, galaxies seem to reverse age, their light showing younger signatures the farther away they are. The implications. Either everything we know about spacetime is flawed or there's an error in the cosmic fabric, similar to a scuff on a record that replays the same note out of order. It's what some physicists call a time fold. Others believe it could be evidence of a glitch in the simulation. One thing is for sure. James Webb might have just demonstrated that time is not linear or as trustworthy as we once thought. And as a result, scientists have been left staring not at responses but rather at a lack of questions too big to comprehend. So here we are on the edge of recognizing, gazing into a cosmos that no longer abides by our previously trusted rules. The James Webb Space Telescope was intended to support our theories and elucidate the universe's origins, to illuminate the unknown. Rather, it has ripped apart the modern script of science. Born of dark stars and the galaxy's creations, shadows grew too quickly. From parallel echoes of realities to the final heartbeat of dying suns, Webb isn't just revealing the universe, it redefines it. 
And as if that were insufficient, the quest has now been joined by artificial intelligence, highlighting anomalies that cannot be explained, patterns that cannot be categorized, and gravitational spirits that linger in the shadows among galaxies. It was the telescope built to see farther than we've ever seen. However, what it discovered may extend beyond what we are willing to accept. If the past few months have taught us anything, it's that space is not silent, not simple, and certainly not solved. What we once called laws may now be guidelines. What we thought was the beginning may only be a checkpoint. The most terrifying aspect, we are only just getting started. Because if this is what James Webb has discovered during its initial forays into the unknown, what comes next could truly break the rules.